Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So we've moved systems, we're at Minky now. We're gonna have a look at the map real quick here. And what I decided to do, we're gonna start heading on our original trajectory. We're gonna start heading north on this map, I guess, to the top. We're gonna start heading towards the clans. And we're gonna be moving back and forth between the different uh, uh, inner sphere houses here as we go along. So we're in uh, uh, compelling confederation space right now. And um, so what we're going to do is we're going to take a few missions here. And it's a two-scale pl uh, planet, but there's lots of other missions here. Now, um, because we've taken a few hits in the, in the past little bit, let's have a look at our mech bays real quick. Um, I did pull the Wolverine forward last episode, but I, I flushed it out again before the financial report just to save a bit of cash. Um, the Centurion is just showing this little thing up here because we didn't have enough weight left over to add anything to it. Uh, we're just missing... Like the armor is full out, so we can't add any more weight to it. Uh, Jager mech, I tried to look at refitting this sucker, but uh, we just don't have the ballistic capacity right now to be able to lay this guy out properly. So we're just going to leave him like he is for now. Um, we're going to jump straight into a mission right now. So let's have a look at the contracts. Now we do need to gen generate a bit of capital here, so we're going to take Pride and Vanity. Um, it is a battle. Chances are it's going to be a couple of lances, three skulls. So we might get a bit of salvage out of this. So we're going to negotiate. We're going to go 50-50, I think. Uh, we're going to basically be shooting to kill, but um, if we can find some good stuff, we're going to take it. Now, we're going to need um, some cash because there's some stuff in the store here. I'm going to have a look, show you real quick here before we jump into that mission. So, with the new um, Rotex system, it's important to have the ability to see your opponents and stuff and have better accuracy. So, there's a few cheap things here in the store that you can get for like 146000 So, this is advanced zoom, give you accuracy bonus of bonus of two that decays with range. The range is every 180 meters. Gives you increased sight range, proves your called shot modifier, and it's only 0.25 tons. So there's a bunch of these in here, different things like that. So there's also IFF Jammer, um, which is basically a low tier ECM that adds one to sensor checks but doesn't enable stealth systems. But you can add this in. Gives you plus one missile defense as well. There's also thermal vision, um, which gives you a bonus of one accuracy for overheating targets, a few other things, and UAV, which gives you increased sight and sensor range. And these are all 0.25 tons, right? So you can add a bunch of these, increase your uh, mech's effectiveness. And because of space being a premium, they've also got all these e-cooling things that you can drop in. There are only one slot in the center of your mech. Um, so this is seven tons, obviously, but it adds seven additional heat sinks. So you don't have to fill up all your side torso and everything with heat sinks. So we're going to be looking at doing a few of those, but in order to do that, we're going to have to gain some capital. So we're going to start taking missions, I think, at 50-50 now. Um, and take not, not, ne not necessarily easy missions, but around two and a half, three skull missions, um, just so that we're not getting completely overwhelmed um, and not taking damage in the process. So, well, not a lot of damage in the process. We'll see how this goes, though. So let's take this three skuller, 50-50. And we're going to drop, we're going to take the Centurion out now because we got these guys back. We can go full weight here. So Victor in. We're going to bring the Hunchback back. I think we're, it's not as tough as it was before. We definitely want the Catapult. So let's get, um, we want the Bushwhacker. I mean, we got, it's got medium and MMLs. It needs to be in close to really do anything. We're going to leave that out, leave the Hunchback in, and we're going to bring the Catapult. Uh, and we're going to deploy this and get it done. Alright, here we go. Battle in the jungle. Okay, they still look worse for wear, but they can definitely hurt us. So, this map's actually pretty simple. Reinforcements on this side. Enemies up here. Uh, we're just going to head up and around. Standing by. So let's get the catapult, maybe back here for now. So long range weapons, um, definitely going to play more of a uh, role in this game. The ER medium laser for me, this is a good, good example of the, that. The ER medium laser uh, inner sphere version was, um, well still is, um, one ton uh, fires for 28 damage and does 15 heat, whereas the normal medium laser um, did uh, 25 damage, uh, was one ton, and was only 10 heat. 
Now, it's always obviously if you're moving quickly and you need to be able to see your enemies in order to shoot them, the medium laser was the better choice generally. Um, now the ER medium is definitely the better choice because as soon as you can see their, there's get them on sensors, you can actually shoot them, right? So um, it's rethinking that kind of idea um, that makes this game even trickier. Um, so you may want to go with less weapons but longer range versions. So you'll be putting out less DPS or damage per turn, um, but you'll be able to do that over a far uh, longer range. So now we've got these guys on sensors. If we can actually get a line of sight, we can start targeting them. Looks like enemy reinforcements. What's up, boss? All right. So like like I said, here we can get a line of sight on this guy. So we're gonna take the shot, I think. Got it. No point in wasting a turn. So what do we got here? Quick draw. Quick draw 60. He's got like no armor, so he's our next target. But we're going to target the cicada here, and we're just going to fire. Okay, two misses. Let's hope for at least one hit. Damage. Definitely need to get some more of those double plus PPCs. Not necessarily the absolute best weapon. But 65 damage for 30 heat at 7 tons is pretty darn good. Considering you can load two of those suckers up and have pretty much the same... Uh, let's do this. Pretty much the same um, damage like as an, as an Ultra 10 for the roughly the same weight. No idea what the chance to hit on that guy would be. 26, 38, 38. See, targeting these guys back here now, right? A hunchback. Uh, let's target the cicada. Might as well. Better chance to hit. Just gonna dump everything on him. All weapons are go. See, you still have a hard chance to hit, but you can destroy your enemies before they even get in within visual range, right? That hit something good. Which is definitely why you want to go with lots of sensors and lots of long-range weapons. Get the meal near on this guy and dump everything into him. Okay, so he's gone. So, once again, we never even saw the guy. He's just gone now. In a way, it's kind of sad because I like the animations of watching mechs get destroyed and stuff, but hence half my name. But still, it's like, you know, eh. The other thing you have to remember too is unless you're back like halfway across the map shooting at the opponents, you have to always be moving. You just can't stand idly by and shoot because they can just target you with long range missiles. Hit you very easily, right? Somebody's got a gas rifle. It's not very nice. I mean, in essence, I guess you could just have somebody, like three of your guys with extremely long-range weapons, um, like just load out with everything with the uh, auto cannon twos, and just stay way back, and then just like, you know, have one guy that moves in and just shoot everybody from a distance. But it's not always going to be. the best. Now spore field plus two difficult four difficulty hitting units. Additional twenty percent damage when we get hit. If we get hit though. We move into here. No shooting. We gotta get up on the hill. So we're gonna push this a bit I think. And six percent, huh? Four. 14. Mm, let's take the shot at it. Might as well try it. Oh yeah, man. Nice. That's like 15% of his armor gone in one shot. I'm receiving you. 
Um, let's get off of here. Double time. Let's go. Yeah, let's just keep firing on the quick draw. It's going to give us the best chance to hit, I think. Yeah, a little bit of damage, not much. Somebody with a Goss back there. So we're going to move out of the way here just so the guy can't hit us. Commander. I mean, in the past you've always had to kind of watch your movement, where you're moving to and who you're going to be firing at. But now it's even more important. Making sure that you can't, people don't have direct line of sight on you. Oh, catapult. Fire at this guy. So like I said, it's very important to make sure you can, you know, at least get in cover at distances. Love the birds. Be nice that they had multiple animations on the, on the animations on the birds, but you can't have everything. So we have a bad chance to hit, but so do they. I hope they do anyway. So it sounds like they still got some issue with the sounds and stuff on these maps. And the animations. Hunchback 50. That's a lot of missiles. Alright, so let's get... Yeah, it's time to do this. Let's see if we can remove this quick draw. Dump everything into him. Okay, nice shooting. Um, two PPCs and a large? Or rather two? Really? Maybe? Maybe? Don't like being on the, uh, the rocky ground here, but we're going to do it anyway. 32%. 29. Let's take it and fire. Come on, hit. Ugh. Can't always get what you want. Man, Steve's moving real slow. Is he gonna melee? Sorry, are they gonna commit suicide? See how close he has to be to be able to actually see him? Yep, gonna commit suicide. Walk impaired, eh? Move impaired, plus 10 heat. Tasered. It's taser face! No idea what this guy's armor is. I guess he's impaired my sensors. Yes, Commander. Um. They really want to try and deny us the high ground here. Really bad chance to hit there. Let's get up here. We're not going to let them deny us the high ground. We'll fight over it if we have to. Let's just dump everything into this guy. Targeting for an alpha strike. Oh, nice. Looks like I only the oh, target. cool. Alright, he's gone. Alright, Rock. Um... No idea what this guy's got. Just gonna pull back. See if we can suck him in. I'm just gonna brace here. What's up, boss? Six percent. Wow. Ten. Thirty-eight. Take a shot at this guy. Might as well. 
Still got a ton of ammo. No joy. Well, two tons of ammo. That was a vehicle. I think they got two vehicles over there. Some kind of missile carrier. I think there's like at least five uh, SR, or sorry, five uh, LRM fives. Okay, he's coming in. He's the next guy we're gonna take on. He did shoot at the Victor. Okay. Armor yeah, relax. We got this. Wow, I can e can't even walk anywhere. I'm taser faced. That's like <laughs> almost no chance to hit here. What if I melee? Even worse, eh? Yeah, we gotta move, so let's just back up. Hang on a vigilance just so we can get our uh, stability back. Wow. Um, we're not even gonna bother shooting. Just gonna res just re reserve here. Generating extra heat because of the taser, I guess. Definitely have to kill this guy. It's gonna mean getting lucky with a shot, I think. Well, we're going on what, 18 this time? Nice. Yeah, stop it. Okay, you missed that time. Good. Commander. All right, Rocky. Hunchbacks are notorious for having back bad back armor, so let's take advantage of that firing. Locking in all weapons. That's a pretty damn good chance to hit up here. I'm gonna take it. Get our stability back. And we're gonna forward this sucker. Gonna dump everything into this raptor. Hopefully we can do some good damage on him, finishing him up with the uh meal near. This should be good. Oh, I thought that was gonna hit for a second there. Alright, we got a head hit on him, that's nice. Still got me slowed, eh? That's a pretty good chance to hit, though. Um, can't get behind him, though, eh? 57. 64. But that's in the open. We don't want to be in the open. 57. Let's keep moving back this way. And we're gonna go with three. Actually, yeah, we'll go with, well, yeah, may as well go with three. Okay, nice two hits on him. Oh, I love that animation. Just goes right through. So I think that guy's got bonus LRMs. Yeah, that's a Marauder too. He's in the water too, so he's getting cooled off every turn. I gotta hurry up and move back so he can't shoot me anymore. But we can only move as far as we can move, so... 
Um, Ooh. Let's do this. Copy that. And we're going to multi-target. We're going to shoot on the hunchback and this guy. We put the light machine guns to B. Maybe we get an extra head hit. Unlikely, but you never know. Hunchback's almost unstable. Nope, no head hit. Had to try though. So as you can tell here, it's a totally different feel of the game. You get to use the whole map board and everything, right? It's gonna melee. Still not gonna save you, buddy. Hellcat still gets to go before. Oh. Taser. Do we have any idea what this guy has now? Still no idea. Come on, turn your back. His name is Taserface. Okay, 38, eh? Is this guy? 26. We're gonna take the shot on this guy. Maybe we get lucky. No. But we can definitely finish up this guy, hopefully. Definitely, hopefully. Into his back. Oh, you hit with him in the wrong spots, buddy. Oh, we still got him. Okay. One left target. Two down. Ow. Damage minimal. That taser's messing me up, man. Okay, we're gonna push him, I guess, next turn with the hunchback. Comes that uh, router too. Okay, good thing he's missing with those. Is this considered crossing through the spores? I mean, it says it is, but I don't think it is. Oh, no, I got hit by the spore, spore cloud. Okay. Um, gonna vigilance again. Gonna shoot this guy. And we're just gonna go with two of the three. Hopefully we get a hit here. Yeah. Yuck. These PPCs aren't helping. Okay. Roger. This guy's giving me problems long enough. Firing full complement on enemy. Oh, I missed with the uh are you kidding me? <sighs> missed with the Thunderbolt, guys. This guy's so fast. Now he's gonna be even more harder to hit. God damn it, stop hitting me with that. I'm receiving you. Hmm. I 
think here. Affirmative. Wasting a lot of ammo trying to hit this guy. We gotta do it, he's gotta be gone. We'll get lucky sooner or later. Waiting for orders. Um before we go after that catapult, let's see if we can oh, yeah. utilize this guy. Got lots of target yeah, plenty of targeting yeah. systems on this guy. Really? The important weapons missed. Solid connection on that one. Wonder if he lost his taser. Possibly. I think it's the white one though. I think that's the taser. He's got lots of armor though still left. Well, not so much left in the CT. <laughs> I can sprint one square. <laughs> Sorry, one hex. We're gonna do it. We gotta keep going. Alright, let's just shoot this guy. We can only shoot him with one. Let's warlord it. And how many can we get going here without burning up a lot of heat? Let's just do two. Oh my god. You gotta hit with one of those guy. Rhino, you're our only hope. Help me, Rhino, in the victory. You're our, you're my only hope. Oh no. Head hit already. All right. Commander. Confirmed. Gonna be out of ammo by the time we face that marauder. Um. Yeah, man. All weapons are go. We missed again. This guy's becoming a nightmare. 75 ton. Okay, the victor and the catapult have to move against their, their catapult. Was that a jump? That was a jump. Oh crap, you got me with two. Warning. Armor low. You think? Well, you know, one of the tool tips is a uh, properly outfitted light can easily take out a poorly outfitted um, assault. This guy's not an assault mech, but he's still doing a good job of taking me apart here. I'm here. Uh, we gotta get on this catapult. Let's just get closer to him. Quick in. Yeah, we're not gonna fire. By. Not with those bad chances to hit. Let's get in a little closer on this guy. Roger that. Good chances firing everything. everything I've got. Well, at least he with the PPC this time. Ah, okay. Had enough, did he? Steve is almost out of direct fire route range. Ugh, I don't know if I want to be there though. Don't want to turn my right side because that's exposing my right leg which is badly damaged now. Down to 54. Just gonna move into here. Hopefully they don't they can't see me and don't shoot me. Okay, this guy's visible now. Oh. Okay. Two can play at that game. Standing by. Except I got a big missile, buddy. Let's hope we hit with it, though. Okay, firing everything. Firing a full battle. Nope.
starting to think now primarily laser builds is going to be a better better way to go don't have to worry about ammo which means you don't have to worry about ammo explosion is that a leg hit again? It was. My god, I'm gonna lose that leg. Yes, Commander. Location confirmed. Take this catapult apart. Inflicted some heavy damage. I'm here. God, it's a terrible chance to hit from there, but we're going to do it. Firing everything. All weapons are good. Okay, at least that hit. I think we're out of their visuals? I think so. We're going to brace here. At least our taser's gone. Okay, he's gonna melee. That's a bonus for us. Rhino still has to go yet. So their main lance is almost gone, then it's gonna be everything on this Marauder 2. Ready for orders. How do we wanna do this now? Um, you're mostly damaged on the one side. Ooh, terrible chance to hit with the Thunderbolt there. Um, That's pretty good. We're just going to back up a little bit. Drop everything onto this guy. Okay, another Thunderbolt hit. What just happened? Okay, partially torsoed. It's going to be terrifying when we have to face this guy straight out. He's in the water with those damn PPCs. we got to get him out of the water. Pretty good chances to hit from there. Even better from here. We're going to move right in. Maybe we can take that uh, right torso. Firing! Oh, looks like we hit it. Two hits on it. Not enough though, I don't think. No. 90 ton vehicle. So this guy got left. We have no idea. Yeah, pretty close to being gone though. Maybe about 25 or so. I'm receiving Hellcat. Ah, so horrible chances to hit. Slightly better, but not much. Double time. Let's, go. Let's hope we get lucky here. No. Damn it. God damn it. Critical hit. Critical hit. Gonna do this. Firing everything into this guy's backside. Okay, finally. Less visual visual chance to see us anyway. Um. 
heading out. Did not mean to do that, but okay. 32. 16. Let's go with the 32. Yeah, we're going to fire. Engaging with target. Come on. Nope. Oh man. Repeat negative damage. Yeah, I saw that. The fact that he's in the water just makes it all the much worse. Standing by. We're on low on ammo. But we're definitely gonna have to fire. Engaging target. Gotta get started on this guy somehow. Okay, good. Receiving you. Just start moving forward and brace. We're still behind the hill up here. I guess the thing is we need to try and crest the hill and everyone fire at one target at a time. Damage minimal. Yeah, I don't want to get down where they can see me. Let's just stay over here. If we went up here, they might be able to see me, maybe. I don't know, it's hard to tell with this map. Camera movements are terrible too, like, really is. Um, Standing by. Roger that. 44% that's pretty good. 10, 23, let's just go with the 44. Take a pot shot. Hopefully target. we hit. Ooh, close though. Failed to connect. So I'm thinking we're gonna crest this hill in a minute. Waiting for orders. Let's try this turn to do this. Well, hopefully we can burn through this guy's side. Waiting for orders. Keeping that left side towards these guys. And we're going to vigilance on this one for sure. Everything into this guy's side. Can't even see if I hit or not. No, I missed. Okay, Ebola. Whatever that is. Reporting minimal damage, Commander. Okay, keep it on the left side. It's too bad we can't actually see these guys, but I guess the ECM and everything makes it hard for harder for us to see. Fire everything on this guy. We have no idea where we're hitting either. I don't know if we hit the head or not. Okay, so just those three guys left. We killed the cicada earlier. So Steve's not in range yet. Don't think I will be next turn either. But we got that bum leg, so we really have to be careful.
Okay, he's visible now. Not sure if that's going to make a difference. In targeting, that is. As long as he's in that water, he's not going to run hot. But as long as he's jumping... Like, that leg is, like, taking a lot of damage. Okay. Yes, Commander. Got our warlord back. We're going to move over here. Location confirmed. Changing the sides that he's going to be shooting at us on. Fire everything. Okay, he's completely unstable now. Yes, Commander. No shooting. Just running. Oh, no, no, no. Shooting and running, buddy. Shooting and running. Remember, we talked about that. Dumping everything straight into this guy. Taking the shot. Okay, he should go down this turn. Oh, I got enough to be able to crest and put my left side over there. That's the 60 and that's the 75. Let's go up to the 60 tonner. Just enough. Mm, let's make it a little better. So I think I want to try and kill this guy if I can. I'm going to fire everything on him. Come on. Three hits, no luck. Ready for orders. Got to give it some movement here, but don't really have any place we can let's do this guess I shouldn't have sprinted but too late now dumping everything on this guy hopefully we can knock him down Roger. that should do it there we go okay three to four three to four Now, is that Marauder getting up, or is that was... Yeah, this is his turn, okay. okay it's a good thing he fell. We gotta attempt to do the same thing this turn. Okay, now I don't even know if he's in the water yet. Or still. Um... I want to start moving down. Probably. Okay. I'm going full throttle. Got to have as much evasion as possible too. So let's have a look at this guy here. Um, really good chances to hit. Let's try a precision strike on his leg. Okay, three hits in the leg. It looked like. Target's taking a critical hit. It's almost gone. I'm receiving you. And we should be able to take it now, though. I'm gonna do this. Confirmed. And I want to split fire. I want to shoot at the 60 tonner. And this guy, uh, Thunderbolt's gonna go to. You know what? Forget it. Everything's gonna go to B. Oh my god. Mech destroyed. That's excellent salvage. Okay, where is he going? Okay, he's revealing the side we shot before, I think. 
can't go there. You know what? We gotta make sure we don't uh, reveal our side to anybody. So we gotta go here and shoot this guy. Wow. Okay, so these guys must have really, really good armor. Wow. Alright, so we're going to move around. Once they finish firing. A lot of ace pilots. Waiting for orders. Definitely worth more now having ace pilot, that's for sure. Aye, aye. Okay, let's shoot this guy. That's all we can shoot. We're gonna fire everything. Roger that. Come on. Oh. No joy. <laughs> Okay, we need to get in here. This guy's mostly damaged on the front, a little bit on the other side. This guy. Hmm, 160, 170. Okay, let's dump everything into him. Firing all way. See what they do here. Yeah, we lost that war first week. God damn it. This was supposed to be an easy mission too. Well, they're gonna run out of room to move very shortly here, I think. So let's just keep going forward. Waiting for orders. We're going to run out of ammo. Three rounds left. Let's leave the Thunderbolt off for now. Fire the LRMs. Confirm. Okay. Pretty good chances there. So we're gonna take it, fire. Wow. Okay, we got him. Enemy unit destroyed. Receiving you. Okay, girl. Let's thunderbolt this. Let's just fire. Affirmative. Maybe we got lucky. Come on. Ah. Well, at least the light AC hit. Okay, where is this guy damaged here? Can't tell right now. He'll tell here in a second. Roger. Full speed. He can't get away. Fire everything. Here it comes. Wow. I'm here. Okay, dumping everything on this guy. 18% chance we'll take it. Got four PPCs coming up. Nice shooting, buddy. So he's got a light gas. I'm under heavy fire. Yeah, but it's clobber in time. Not gonna move. Vehicle stealth is destroyed. Okay, we got one left. Let's hope it hits. Target confirmed. <laughs> it hits, but it's not enough. AC twenty ammo depleted. <laughs> Ready 
ready for orders. Right side? Where's that right side? Well, at least we shoot it from the back. We should have a chance to kill it. So let's just go right here. Jammed by ECM. I copy. That should do it. Yep. All right, folks. Reporting. Mission. All right, so that was a super long mission. 587,000. And a lot of damage. So you can see what I mean. It's a little trickier to try and figure out what we needed to do here. Definitely need more ECM. Definitely need more visual targeting systems. So we're going to need to rehaul everything, I think. It's going to make getting things like NSS is way more important. Um, rod or two parts, maybe. But let's see what else we got down here. Um, there might be some vital components we're going to need here. Oh, I want these. Okay, advanced AMS, plus two missile defense, plus one ally missile defense, plus one defense against being hit by missile attacks for the lance, reduce damage by missile attack. That's actually really good. C3I, improve, resolve for action gain, plus five sensor range for the lance, Plus five increased sight range for the lance. Shares sensor information. I remember what the C3s did, but I don't know if you need to have a C3 slave and all of the other mechs for, in order for it to work or not. Excel engines we could sell. Guardian. Heat banks. Cooling pods. Mask. Oh, it's difficult to find these things. And NSS. Such good stuff. And I wanted those Mara 2 parts too, but I think we need to take things like this now. Um, so let's go that route. And confirm. Okay, two catapult parts. Hunchback part, one, two, three, Marauder 2 parts. Oh, nice. Raptor 2 part, okay. And that's it, AMS and NSS. Well, at least we got all mech parts, that's good. All right, see what we got here. 192,000. Okay, it's a lot more than I thought it was going to be. But, you know, we do what we do. Uh, let's manage our tasks a bit here. So the hunchback needs to be refit. Um, catapult and Mjolnir. So let's do get catapult, then Mjolnir next, then Victor. So it's going to take us past the financial report. Unfortunately, god damn it. Um, we almost made enough for the financial report, so let's look at that. Uh, well, you know, I'll do it between episodes. I'm going to get the lance fixed up between episodes. Um, be right back here ready to fight. Um, we do have a few other contracts here, so I think I'll gear down from, from uh, three skull. Go back down to two. Maybe there's like some, well, this is like no cash. Cease and desist is terrible. Maybe we can pull off a couple of these missions. Well, maybe this one. On guard is pilots from your federal science issue a direct challenge versus your lance. Supporting advanced equipment, eh? Wouldn't trust these guys to play fair though, eh? Well, we can't risk that right away. Hollow vid is a defend the base. Tamper proof, yeah. So we may switch systems between episodes. Although this one redirection is an escort mission to 625 salvage. So, I mean, we could do the cease and desist really quick and then do this one right, a right afterwards. Maybe pick up some good salvage. And we'll do this one for cash. And then this one for salvage. Most likely. So that that'll be in the next episode. Um, but we're going to end it here. And get these guys fixed between episodes. And then when we come back, we'll uh, hammer out another mission or two. Um, so if you like the episode, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and also drop some comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you all later.